Cochin Airport is known for its temple-like architecture and for being India's fourth largest airport in terms of international traffic. But ask anyone about its latest environmental breakthrough using solar energy and this is the reaction you'll get. I'd say you're bluffing. <laughs> you're serious? Wow. Yeah, I'm very surprised. And I'm very happy for the Indian people. <laughs> Even the man behind the idea was unaware what he was doing was unique. We realized that the Kerala State Electricity Board was actually charging a little on the higher side. We thought, why not we go in for the green power? So the whole idea came in. We, we worked out like, you know, we consume about 48,000 of units of power a day. So why not we produce almost equivalent to that? The project took six months to set up and cost $10 million. The airport expects to recoup all costs within five years. Next to the airport, in an area for a proposed cargo terminal, there are more than 46,000 solar panels. The 12 megawatt plant will provide around 50,000 units a day to cover all the airport's electricity needs. The carbon footprints goes down, so very good, because it is eco-friendly, renewable energy. So this is to be practiced in almost all places. The solar panels are expected to last for 25 years. And during that time, we'll cut 300,000 metric tons of carbon dioxide emissions. That's the equivalent of planting 3 million trees. This falls in line with the government's targets to increase the use of solar power by five times by 2022. India is heavily reliant on coal and is the world's third largest polluter. So, over the next decade, the government is planning to invest around $100 billion into the solar sector. The government is hailing this as a model for the rest of the country and has already directed other airports to start incorporating solar energy into their daily operations. Divya Gopalan, Al Jazeera, Kochi, Kerala.